don't know. It's hard. The dude at the window, he's supposed to, oh shoot, she didn't came up here looking fly. Look how cute. It is so stinking cute. What it do, y'all? Welcome back to my channel, family. Welcome back to another Self Love Tuesday. Y'all know that's my favorite day of the week because I get to do what I want as I want, as I should, as I, whatever. Yeah, y'all know, it's my day, it's Tuesday, I get to do me, you know what I'm saying, at my timing, at my pace, literally have nothing else to do but whatever it is I want to do, literally. So that's why it's my favorite day and I just get to love on myself. Um, self care and self love is a must in your life. No matter what, you can't get by without self care and self love. And you are self care and self love in any ways that you're treating yourself to the hair salon, the nail salon, um, the movies, dinner, um, cleansing your face, brushing your teeth, um, moisturizing your skin, accepting all your flaws, loving on yourself. That's all a part of self-care and self-love. That's why I love it and it's my favorite day even though I do it every day. Self-care and self-love is in my life every day but this is the day where I literally just I do me. Like every day you might have to go to work or just whatever and this day is just for me. So anyway, my arm is hurting right now. <laughs> and I'm gonna set y'all down right here. I have on my camera bag that I'm wearing for the second time. I have to exchange my stuff out though. Like my stuff is still in this purse. And I need to decide which shades I'm wearing because I have some black ones and I have some olive green ones and my boots are out of green, so yeah. Let's put this stuff in here. And my lotion and hand sanitizer is in the car. Oh, I need to put this pen back in the car. This pen came out of the car, and I'm gonna take it back out there. I need to spray on me some perfume. And yeah, I need y'all to help me decide whether we're these black shades or these olive shades. Hold All on, right, y'all. Question these olive green glasses. Can y'all even see them? Let me turn up the light a little bit. These olive green glasses. Do I need to zoom in? Okay. So yeah, these olive green shades. Another look. Do a little pose so you can get it. So you can get it like <laughs> the whole outfit. Matter of fact, let's see the whole outfit. The olive green boots, black jeans, white sweater, olive green, white, coral, whatever, uh, hair wrap. Uh, yeah, so this is the olive green. Let's see the all black shades and see how they look. Or the black shades. These are the black ones. Zoom in, give you a look. But yeah, these are the black ones. So, no, okay, yeah. These are the black ones. What do y'all think? Which one? Hold on, wait. Which one suits the outfit better? I don't know. It's hard. Um, it's like, should I take a picture? He had called me back down there. He was like, uh, you know, you want to look at everything to make sure everything's good before we leave or whatever, or if I need to move anything. But, okay. you know, I guess they just left it to how I want to uh, put the pillows. So, he's like, is everything good? I'm like, yeah. These lips. These lips are ashy. These lips don't make no sense. I need to go to the freaking gas station. What's new, though? <laughs> hey, y'all. I'm back. I'm saying I'm back. Like, y'all don't know, like... <laughs> I just pulled up at Tim Hortons. Um, I came up here before when I was picking up somebody's order and I saw that they had avocado toast. Right? I know, right? Tim Hortons got av avocado. Girl, I can't even talk. And they got a whole new menu. Let me tell you, I haven't been to Tim Hortons in so long because I just <sighs> got addicted to um, Starbucks. But Tim Hortons be having the stuff. I'm about to show you. I'm gonna turn y'all around while this menu is flipping. Right here, 
look they have um anytime snackers like pastry squares look spicy jalapeno ice cap donuts cold brew i'm talking about like they got a whole new menu you see that them drinks right there them boosts and they got like red bull and stuff in it but i don't want that but yeah like maple waffle breakfast sandwich like that sounds so good and the avocado toast if y'all can see it it's on the other menu over there right there at the top i don't know if y'all can see it but yeah it say toast right there at the top i think i'm gonna try that because yeah it just seemed like the right thing to do those um snackers i don't i don't know now far as the drink i don't know what i want do i want a coffee or do i want some type of like juice drink but yeah i'm gonna finish looking at the menu even though i probably need to put my glasses on to see that dang on far oh yeah they got some refreshers usually get a refresher and uh something to eat Rewards member, we'll be right with you okay and you know what i mean rewards member i think i deleted the app and everything i'm a straight starbucks girl now hi what can i get for you um i think i want to try that avocado toast avocado toast yeah and for our refreshers we have blackberry mint orange tangerine and strawberry coconut Strawberry coconut sounds good. What's in there though? It's a juice concentrate mixed with water and green tea. Oh, okay, yeah. Um, yes, ma'am. Okay, I'll have that. What, the, what, kind, what the, flavor would you like? I'll try that strawberry coconut. Strawberry coconut? Yeah. Okay, how, it leave it how it is? Yeah, I just hope it's still good. I just hope it's good. <laughs> small, medium, or large? Uh, I'm going to go with a small. Large? I'm going to go with a small this a small? time. Yeah. At least Anything until I know how it tastes. That'll be all. Thank you. 752. All right. Oh, I still got the Tim Hortons app on here. <gasps> I haven't been here in so long. I forget. Wow. Tim Hortons is loading. Wow. Okay. Man, I wish I would have just had the camera. <laughs> the dude at the window. He's supposed to, Oh, shoot. She didn't came up here looking fly. <laughs> Like, he probably was standing in his head and it just came out loud. I sneakered a little bit, but I'm like, dang, I wish I'd had a camera so y'all could have heard how he sounded saying it. That was the funny part, how he sounded, not what he said. <laughs> so anyway, I got my um, strawberry with coconut milk refresher. I'm about to taste it right here because if I don't like it, I'm going to return it and ask for a different flavor because... I mean, I'm not about to drink something that's nasty like that. So anyway, this is the avocado. Oh, can y'all see? This is the avocado toast and how it comes and how it looks inside of the box. Sorry, it's like I thought it was dark, but I just couldn't see because I got on shades. So I'm about to taste both of them. This is probably going to be good. Because I love their bread because I get this bread when I get the... Um, grilled cheese from here so I know the bread is good. It's refresher. I'm not even going to take off my Invisalign to taste that. I'm back. I was trying to get a picture before I opened anything or you know. Do I need to stir this? Yeah, it looks like everything is at the bottom. It's a whole lot of sweet. It's a whole lot of sweet. I done had a strawberry drink before too, but now they doing it as a refresher with coconut milk. I used to drink their strawberry drinks all the time. Okay, yeah, okay, when you stir it up, it gets better. When you first drink it, it tastes straight like syrup. I can do this. Mm. Oh my God. Oh my God, y'all. It's a hit. It's a hit, y'all. It's a hit. It's a hit. It's a hit. Mm-hmm. Mm. All right, next. <laughs> That'll do, honey. Next up is the avocado toast. <laughs> We're going to take off these Invisaligners. I didn't even realize. I bought some new flossers from Target. Um... And I didn't put no new ones in there, but it's one in there. All right, let's see, let's see the picture. Oh, 
Girl, I got avocado all on my phone. Oh my God. I knew it was gonna be good. Didn't I say that? I knew, I wasn't worried about this. It was the drink I was worried about. But honey, mm. Mm. my total was seven fifty two. Did good. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh my god! Did I just get avocado on my face? I mean, even though that one hurt. straight smashed. All oh, gone. <laughs> now I just gotta drink my drink and. Lost. Trying to make sure ain't nothing in my teeth while I'm just talking to y'all. But anyway, we're on our way up to Old Navy because y'all know it's fall. Clearly, I have on this thick white sweater, and I forgot to tell y'all. Y'all probably already know I got the I got this sweater from Forever 21. My jeans came from Forever 21. The olive boots I have on came from Target. These earrings came from Forever 21. I love a thick big earring for um just to have they look a little they look a lot better to me my preference to me than those thin silver earrings now if it's a certain look you're going for fine but mainly like i'm i'm gonna have a thick big pair of silver earrings and, and as, you know as my accessories i just have to have it i love it it just give off a different kind of look than the thin ones to me but um what else um the scarf i don't know probably came from like meyer long 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 time ago or somewhere like that um my accessories silver my silver michael kors watch my silver um k jewelry bracelet that my mom got me no makeup just some moisturizer and some cleanser. Oh, I do have some mascara on my eyelashes. One coat. I forgot I did put a coat of mascara to like comb my lashes out. I did one coat of that. So yeah, I do have on a little mascara, but that's it. Um, like I said, on my way up to Old Navy because it was fall, I just got all off subject. I mean, not, not off subject, but still, anyway. On our way to Old Navy because it's sweater and jeans season. Y'all know it's fall and I live in Michigan and it's 60 degrees outside today. So that's enough for you to put on your cute sweaters, your scarf, your boots, your jeans, your joggers, you know, stuff like that. My favorite season. So I'm gonna go up to Old Navy because they be having like good sales. I be loving their sweaters, their flannels and jeans and stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna do a little try on haul in the what is that? In the fitting room. Let's see if I can find something. I just need like some cute sweater. They don't even have to be sweater sweater. It could be like turtleneck, um, long sleeve, um, what is them called? When they be having like the big bunch neck, like if you have like a whole bunch of around the neck part. Um I don't know what it's called, but if they even have something like that, that'll be cute. But yeah, or like some cute, like thick leggings. It don't even have to be jeans. Oh, I passed my exit. But I, this is, I still look up on this exit. Just running my mouth. Anyways, I see y'all. Right, we'll be fitting room. This is what I have on and wore. This is what I already had on, you know that. And this is all the stuff I'm gonna be trying on. All these dresses. Hey y'all, the music was playing extremely loud up in Old Navy, so I can't like talk over it. But these are some wide-legged, super high-waisted jeans. They were $49.99. They were not on sale, but they were super cute to me. And I love the wide leg. And these are a size four. And I love the way they fit on me. Like they're not too tight on my thighs. I love that wide leg room because it just looks so cute and flattering to me. I also think some really cute pumps will go so cute with these jeans. Now, these are the OG high-waisted rip jeans. I freaking love them because the rips above the knees, like, oh my God, and both of them, so freaking cute. And this sweater, 
man it's like a hunter green or some type of green and i'm loving these greens lately especially for fall this is like a crew neck knitted sweater and it's so comfy it was on sale for like 25 dollars, i believe and these high-waisted jeans guess what on sale for like 11 or 12 dollars must grab these are a size four i love the way they fit on me gonna be so cute especially if i wear them with like some boots or some heels it'll be really really cute or you can dress them down also and just put on some cute sneakers with it and it'll be cute but yeah this sweater feels really good i love the way the sleeves are on the sweater also it kind of like puff up at the bottom and also here i'm showing you that i tuck the sweater into the bra to give you like that more flattering look and give the sweater a little bit more personality than just wearing it straight down and I love the neck part it's just so cute and so comfy these are the ankle straight leg jeans also if I didn't say that part these jeans right here were a size six but I hated them like I don't like the way they fit on me they look uh, like I, I just didn't like it. it they wasn't flattering at all but the sweater I wanted to show you how you can style the sweater and make it look so much better and different if you're going for like a certain look but definitely no to the jeans I'm shaking <laughs> no but that sweater was really 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 cute and comfy but it was like $55 I'm like uh I don't think so but you can zip it up also and wear it around your neck and keep warm i was like you know what uh now i might need to spend this 55 dollars because i'm feeling real warm and comfy right now now let's get into these off-white flare jeans high-waisted with the secret slim pockets let's get into it now these are a size four. Oh my goodness i love the way they fit on me i'm not even like let's just get straight into it okay the way these fit on my body and then have the split in each leg honey listen this brought me straight back to old school okay i'm like okay the fit on these are cute okay of course i wanted to try on some all black joggers it's like you know what I'm saying? They black and they joggers. So these were extra small and I think they're like $25 and they're not on sale. Now, don't get me wrong. They comfy and all and they're cute, but I just feel like, I don't know, $25 and they're not that thick. Uh... So right here, I'm showing that I flipped the top band up to kind of give me like a little bit more fit. And you know what? That did make it look a little bit better. But I just, I don't know. Something is just telling me don't spend $25 for these joggers because I can get some from somewhere else for a little cheaper or a bit better quality for my money. Now, I love the way they fit on me. Okay, off to the next color, which is like off-white cream or whatever you want to call it. I definitely didn't like these because these were actually thinner to me than the black ones. Like, they're cute and all, but I just feel like I know where to get some joggers at for cheaper than this with a little better quality. I'm just not liking the way they fit on me. I actually like the way men's and boys' joggers fit on me better sometimes, depending on which brand, but uh, no. Okay, let's get into this heathered knit midi dress with the split, honey. Let me tell you, this is an extra small and it's on sale for like $25 or something like that. But yeah, love the way it fit on me. And y'all know I'm loving the color. Like this color is just so just appealing to me lately. I'm really loving it. And the way it just fit and feel this is a yes i'm like yes i could throw this on with some boots yes all right this dress is an extra small and it's a fitted long sleeve mock neck dress i really love mock necks i always been into mock necks it just seemed real flattering to me i love the way this dress fit on me i love the color i feel like you can wear it with a whole lot of different color shoes or boots or heels and stuff but I'm like is it too too simple or is it a grab that's what I'm trying to decide right now but I really really do love the color all 
all right y'all just got out of old navy and uh i got most of everything i tried on except for those jeans did i get that dress i might have did still get that dress i think i still got that tan dress i was thinking about not oh yeah i got it because i thought about it i was like you know what I'm going to probably end up needing that dress and wish that I had got it because I'm just going to wear it with like my my leather cognac wraparound belt with like some cognac, my cognac flat boots. I was like, you know what? That's the perfect outfit. I was like, it looked as simple, but I thought about it. I was like, I could just put my belt purse around it and then spruce it up with the boots. But, so yeah, so I still got that. Um, I think I'm about to head to Gadiax. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, to get me, uh oh, I'm like, where's my phone? It's black. It blended in with the purse. To get me some banana pudding because I've been wanting some of that banana pudding for quite some time. Ever since I tried the carrot cake, I never went back and tried the banana pudding, and I'm not letting it pass today. So hopefully it's open because last time, actually, you know what? I did go back to get the um. How you spell it? I forgot. I did go back to get the banana pudding one time. Remember, it was Soul Love Tuesday, and they were remodeling, so it was closed and stuff. So, oh, I know how to spell it. Okay, there we go. Miles, that's not that far. But yeah, I went there for Soul Love Tuesday one day. They were remodeling. I couldn't get my banana pudding, so today we're gonna try again for the banana pudding. And All right, the, there we go right there on the corner the pink bushes as y'all can see over there We went there once before to get some carrot cake, but today i'm gonna try and see if I can get some banana pudding All right, here it is y'all it looked like they definitely extended it and remodeled because it looked like you can go in from this side This sign was not on this side last time and it was not where you can walk in so I guess they did remodel Halloween cakes. Oh, look at this um, banana pudding. Is that what this box cookies on there? Wow. That looks really, really good. Everything looks good. Oh, look at the banana pudding. $10. $10. <laughs> oh, chairs the yellow it's so cute and they got them over there then you can sit at the bench like right there all the little flowers look at the wall so cute isn't it a cute so cute in here and those lights sorry even the lights are cute but yeah that's outside also where you can sit outside and eat but Y'all yeah, know it's cold, so yeah. But yeah, this is so cute. Look at the um the little tree right there. So freaking cute in here. Oh, look at this. They look like little um envelopes hanging. I didn't even realize that they look like they're envelopes hanging. That's cute. Okay, so I was gonna um take it home. But then I was like, put away. You can see. Anyways, like I was saying, I was gonna take it home, but then I was like, you know what? I might as well try it here because if I don't like it, I'm here. <laughs> but yeah, so they gave me a plate and a spoon and a fork. It's really good. I just took the top off, so I would like to take a picture of it also to just get a nice little picture of it, maybe for a thumbnail or just to look back and see 
just to look back at the picture. Where I end up getting a cute picture, if y'all can see. It's so cute. Now let's hope it's good, as good as it looks. Take my name on this one and I forgot to bring my freaking trays in, so I'm gonna set it on the... Oh, let me get a nap, yeah, I'll be back. All right, y'all. First bite. Mm. Oh my. I already knew though. I already knew. The carrot cake was so good. I knew it. Oh my god. Mm. I'm not gonna eat all this. I promise. Oh my god. Mm. This is so good, y'all. It's worth the ten dollars. It's very much worth it. Mm. Alright, y'all. I gotta go. <laughs> Alright, y'all. I tried not to eat it all, but I failed. I couldn't stop. Yeah. I, I just couldn't stop. I'm y'all from this way like look how cute it is so stinking cute in here i just love it and these machines let me show you well they're not actually machines but they kind of give you the vibe of machines but they're not actually machines so cute and this is the actual store right here like that's so cute All right, y'all. Just came up out of the. Is it called pestis? Pedicuria? Uh, a little bakery shop. Just came up out of the bakery shop, or whatever you want to call it. It's like a pastry kind of like place, but how do you say it? I should ask them. But anyway, I'm thinking about ordering and picking up tacos. And just, you know, we can chill and eat in the basement and, um, you know, kind of vibe out and break the couch in and chill down there, you know what I'm saying? And without me cooking. So, I'm about to hey, look up. Hey, I've been back home for a while. Enough to fold up um, a load of clothes and a load of towels and rags. And so, I'm just hanging up my... Um, Stuff that I supposed to hang up that I wash that get hung up instead of folded up but yeah I'm in a basement I think I'm about to call Raymond and just see where he's at so maybe he can grab tacos I need to put this in my beauty closet my scarf but yeah I need to tell see where he's at to see if he can grab tacos for the night and I'm about to change this sweater and um, hang this sweater back up also so, hold on one second. It's cold out here now. It is freezing. I'm it's cold out there. I threw on a jogging outfit and my little um, jacket also. I'm on my way to Del Taco to get me and Raymond some tacos and some fries so we can have movie night and chill on out. No cooking for me is definitely self-love Tuesday because I'm self-loving all the way around. I ain't cooking at all, okay? Just Not touch your skill. Um, I'm looking at the menu back here because somebody was up there, but he's moving up now, so I can go ahead and move it up also. Oh look at that. What kind of shake is that? Welcome to my taco. What can I crush you today? Um I think I'ma take two number one. But on one of them I don't want tomatoes okay um, what would you like to drink hmm that's a good question um one second <laughs> all right y'all i'm back home i'm gonna set us up some food trays this one right here all right y'all i got some tacos which is the dale taco one look at this this is about to be up on the tray because this is a mess I said no tomatoes on one order of them. I was about to say. About I, yeah. So I got two of those. And 
some fries and a fruit punch. We're about to watch um, Fortress Sniper's Eye with Bruce Willis. I'll let y'all know how I was it when the movie go off. Whoa, that's a little bright there. But anyway, I'm saying that I'm about to do the treadmill because I wasn't able to do it early in the day. I was waiting on the furniture people to come and I just didn't get on, no excuse. So here I am at, I think it's 11 or 11.30 at night and I'm about to get on the treadmill. So that's all I'm telling you, but I have the music on and stuff and I'm trying to talk and Raymond working in the background, getting the other part of the basement back together. So that's all I'm showing you that I'm still doing it no matter what, no excuses, no matter what time it is. I'm on it, okay? I'm not going to not do it on Tuesday because that's my day to do treadmill. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to push the post notification bell. But for now, your girl is out. Peace.